Hello my dear subscribers, uh, I, I love you because uh, uh, you're giving me uh, the communication, you're giving me possibility to develop my channel. Please subscribe, subscribe to my channel and uh, be my patron, uh, order me the new topics for my content and very interesting topics, very interesting uh, themes will be the uh, uh, content of new, next my videos. So I want to say about, a little bit about the uh, situation of our country with the um, economy, with the uh, manufacturing. Manufacturing in our country is uh, in a bad position. Why, you know? Because, uh, for example, uh, all the uh, companies who are making the sales uh, they taking the taxes, tax, additional taxes, what, for example, from the customers. But uh, the uh, last what will come to local our uh, manufacturers. And that's why manufacturers have a big from the, their high costs to the producing the products and of course or free twice uh, triple uh, taxes because uh, uh, it's a what it's a what in the uh, raw materials is what in the energy they using to the produce the products and all these things giving the high um, press uh, high uh, cost to, to making the manufacturing in our country and uh, of course, uh, uh, this is one of the reasons why manufacturers in our country is not a lot here. And that's why uh, I see one positive thing for international investors for the, from the different countries who want to catch up with the developing markets. Uh, I see that uh, that's why, that's why we, because uh, we are, have no enough uh, manufacturers, uh, this uh, place is free, this uh, blue ocean. Uh, for the businessmen who want to bring, uh, who want to scale uh, his uh, manufacturing. So our country, I think uh, we have uh, some problems with the legislation, with the court system, with the investment uh, uh, customs somehow. But uh, uh, I think uh, our country now going to be ready to meet uh, investors who interested in the building the high technology uh, manufacturing in our country and that's why this niche is free only four percent of uh, heavy manufacturing here we have uh, the uh, processing of foods and other things is close to 11 percent and uh, 90 percent uh, 80 percent of our economy is uh, services and sales and uh, sometimes our uh, uh, the re-exportation, it means that our country buying something and selling it to the other countries, for example, to Kazakhstan, to Russia and to other countries uh, with additional cost. So uh, if we will see to all the, uh, uh, the uh, economical uh, exportation, importation saldo, it uh, shows us that the, every year we're losing $3 billion from our economy because uh, we're paying with our uh, dollars and another currency to the uh, another countries to take their goods and to bring their goods to our markets. And uh, uh, because we have a little number of uh, local uh, manufacturers, uh, that's giving us the situation that uh, it's a not big uh, scale of exportation and that's why uh, they have no a big flow of money in entering to the country and uh, establishing in the country's economy. That's why we very need manufacturers here and I can say if you are big boss if you have a manufacturing if you want to scale one of the country there you can scale you can build the uh, factory it's a Kyrgyz Republic come to here I have a big experience to uh, I wrote uh, close to 60 projects and uh, feasibility studies to establish a local factories uh, enterprises and I will help uh, we, we can do some work to build your uh, factory in our country and to protect your rights and uh, to make the communication with the government to save uh, some uh, uh, LSCM chains and uh, of course uh, to find the right legislation to protect you and to make you more um, strong on our market. 
but one one thing we waiting from you technology transferring we waiting from you new knowledge to our local uh, people jobs job places and uh, of course uh, and knowledge 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 to be a part of a civilized civilized world to stop the migration from our country to other to another countries to developed countries to build uh, the development point here in Kyrgyz Republic because in the future I see a big potential of Kyrgyz Republic and that's why uh, they are in logistical center uh, the landlocked country, yes, but if we will find uh, ways to produce something here, we uh, will uh, take any direction in, our, in Eurasia for delivering the goods. So, if you're a big boss in big manufacturing holding company, please help to our country, because you will find here one, point, uh, one little point of your development, but it will be uh, the point, profitable point. So, let's uh, write me in the comments, let's find me in social media and LinkedIn and make the communic and communicate with me. I, I will be glad to be useful for you, uh, my subscribers. I uh, believe that around you, you have a, you are businessmen, you are uh, uh, the people who can make something good, change the world and make the development of this uh, crazy world because uh, only development, only high life level it's a preventing measure, a preventing act to stop this madness in the world, wars with the uh, uh, insecurity and this uh, some events that making us in a fear, in a afraid we can stop it only by the development. Thank you for subscribe. See you in next videos.